cytochrome B450. Okay. It's one of the most important in kinetics, guys. One of the most important, okay? It's responsible, responsible for phase one metabolism. Okay? And let's say it represents a family of iso enzymes that responsible for pio transformation of many drugs via what via oxidation okay process and let's say that these enzymes these enzymes are him containing members or in the in the, in the uh, we can found it in the membrane protein which located in a smooth endoplasmic reticulum okay of several tissues and then present an exam before that asked about that cytochrome p450 can present where and give some of choices one of them the smooth endoplasmic reticulum Okay, because all of people know that cytochrome P450 in liver. So he didn't ask about the location as in the liver. It say where in the liver, where in the cell, in the endoplasmic reticulum. Okay, and the higher concentration of it, higher concentration of it, Present in liver. Present in liver. But it completely absent from where from muscles and erythrocytes it's not present in the red blood cells and not present in the muscles okay okay guys one of the most important about that when i talking about that cytochrome p450 it contain many isoenzymes like cyto the, the measure that we should to know about them because i will talk about them in the uh, pharmacogenetic cytochrome p 2 d 6 2 c 9 2 c 19 3 a 4 that's the measure that's the measure uh, uh, cytochrome that we will talking about it Okay, 2C9, 2C19, uh, 2D6, 3A4, all of them are very, very, very important when we discuss about them in the future in pharmacogenetics and so on. Okay, and let's say that the most, 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 most important in the lecture today, 
which is the that enzyme inducers and enzyme inhibitors. It's very important. Okay, so we need to discuss about them. Okay, great. Here. Okay. I can write here, guys, about these enzyme inhibitors and enzyme inducers. Okay, enzyme inducers, enzyme inhibitors. Okay, enzyme inducers. I will make it easier, so easier for you guys. So listen to me, Carl carefully about it okay we will say parbs funny mom refuses gracie Gracie, carbs, shakes. Parbs funny man refuses Gracie carbs shakes okay i think it is very funny okay so if we need to discuss about them barbs which are barbiturates funny which is phenytoin mum which is modafinil antiviral refuses rifampin of or rifampicin gracie gracie violin carbs carbamazepine shakes which is that st jones Ward, St. John's Ward, which is a plant. Okay, that's about the enzyme inducers. The most common enzyme inducers are barbiturate, phenytoin, modafinil, rifampin, uh, grisigolding, carbamazepine, St. John's Ward. Okay, so what about the enzyme inhibitors? I will make it easier to when I say Queen Gigi is going to race. Station.
When I say queen, I mean by this queen. Gigi, which is Jim Febrizel. Is is Aizunia Zait? Grind G, G, which is about that grapefruit. Race. R is referring to Retunavir. Retunavir. A is referring to Azoles. All Azoles. Ketokon Azol, Vermic Azol, Azoles. C is referring to Cymedidin. E is about that erythromycin. And S of a station is referring to sulfonamides. So I think it's easier now. Okay. Which is that Parbus funny mum refuses greasy carbs shake, which are inducers. Barbiturate, phenytoin, modifinil, rifambin, grisivalvin, carbamazabine, stigens. And about the enzyme inhibitors like queen GG is going to race station, which is queen quenidin, GG, which is gym fibrosil, is, is isoniazide, guain G, which is grapefruit, race. Which is that retinavir, azoles, cimetidin, erythromycin, uh, and about the station, which is a sulfonamide. Okay, guys? I think this is the most important, very, 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 very important. Why? Because if you given any of this drug as enzyme inducer, it will induce the metabolism of other drugs. And if you're given a drug of enzyme inhibitors, that is will uh, inhibit the, in the metabolism of the other drug. Like what? To make you understand about it. When I say that a girl that administer oral contraceptive, Okay, and at the same moment, she administered something like that phenytoin. So, this meaning she has a risk of pregnancy or not? Yes. Yes. Why? Because phenytoin will make consumption of the oral contraceptive, metabolism of oral contraceptive very, very quickly because it's enzyme inducer. So, now the risk for pregnancy is huge. Because the oral contraceptive not give action. Okay? And the other, in the other hand, when I say that a, a person that administer warfarin, for example, and at the same moment he administer ketoconazole, that is increase the bleeding or increase the coagulation process. It will be bleeding, sorry. Why? Because it inhibits the metabolism of the drug. So it will make what? It will make toxic effect of the drug, which means bleeding. Okay, guys? Yes. 